Hello everyone. Welcome back to our channel, PC Error Fix. Seeing frustrating Unity player DLL not found or missing error while trying to run a game or application. In this video, I'll guide you through a step-by-step -step troubleshooting process to help you resolve the Unity player DLL not found error and get back to enjoying your games or applications hassle-free. The Unity Player DLL not found error arises when games and other software are unable to access that file when needed. Luckily, there are solutions that works for you to fix the error and download Unity Player DLL file. Solution 1 Check the recycle bin. Solution 2 Download the Unity Player DLL file. Solution 3 Re register the Unity Player DLL file. Solution 4. Create an exception Windows Defender. Solution 5. Reinstall the application or game. Now before starting with the detailed steps in this video, don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel also ring the bell to get notified when another video lands. Solution 1. Check the recycle bin. The first step is to check if the unityplayer.dll file has been accidentally deleted and is sitting in your recycle bin. Let's see if it's there. Double click on the recycle bin icon on your desktop. Use the search bar in the recycle bin to look for unityplayer.dll. If you find it, right click on it and choose restore. This will put the file back in its original location. Solution 2. Download the unityplayer.dll file. If the file isn't in the recycle bin, then you need to download and install the unityplayer.dll file manually and check if all works fine. Open your browser and visit the site to download the unityplayer.dll file directly from the browser. Click the download button to download the unityplayer.dll zip file on your system. Now, move this DLL file to the following path on your PC. Restart your system and check if the error appears or not. Solution 3. Re-register the unityplayer.dll file. Re-registering the DLL file will remove any corrupted section and replace it with a new file. Here follow the steps to do so. Press the Windows plus R key and type Command. Press Ctrl plus Shift plus Enter to run the command prompt as an administrator. Type the given command shown on the screen, then press Enter. Now, wait for all the files to re-register. After the process is complete, you can restart the computer. Solution 4. Create an exception Windows Defender. The Windows Defender can stop an application from accessing some files as detecting a threat from any DLL file. So, creating an exception in the Windows Defender to give full access will work for you. Here's how you can do it. Go to Start and type Windows Security and open it. Click on Virus and Threat Protection a new dialog box will appear. Under Virus and Threat Protection Settings, click on Manage Settings. Scroll down to Exclusion and select Add or Remove Exclusion. Click on Add an Exclusion and then File. Browse the executable file of your application and press open. Now the program is added in the exception list, try running it to check if the error gets fixed or not. Solution 5. Reinstall the application or game. Try reinstalling the application or game that's showing the error. This often includes the missing DLL file. Press Windows plus I keys and select Apps. Here, select the program from the list of installed applications. Select it and click on the Uninstall button. Confirm your action in the next pop-up screen. Now, reinstall the program from the trusted source. The installation process should include the necessary unityplayer.dll file. By following these steps, you should be able to fix the unityplayer.dll not found or missing error. Now, you can get back to enjoying your games and applications without any interruptions. I hope this troubleshooting guide was helpful to you. If you found it useful, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more gaming tips and tricks. 
Feel free to leave any questions or comments down below. Thanks for watching.